Uh, so this is going to come straight this way. And that will touch there. That'll be fine. Actually, how long is that station? That might not be long enough. So that might not be fine. What? Oh, don't have enough money. <laughs> anyway, let's get back over here. Oh, this is a bloody long station. Uh, we're looking at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 stations. Oh, station pieces. Uh, we are currently in negative money. We really don't want to be in negative uh, money. We really, really don't want to be. Because I don't want to go bankrupt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm just going to do that because we really don't need to have a full length station, especially if it's going to have a regular train now. $14,000 for this train. Oh, I can't afford it. <laughs> of course. All right, fast forward. Let's get some money. We got the big payoff when those two trains come in here, so that's always good. We got $5,000. The other one should be coming very shortly. Uh, uh oh, that's not anything I'm using, is it? Oh, I'm not using that refinery. I hate when the refineries close, especially at the beginning of the game, if the refineries close down while you're trying to build to them. It is the worst, because your you game is pretty much screwed up <laughs> at that point. Uh, because you don't have any more money. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, we've got $8,000. Should get a bit more money when that comes through. $13,000. We're now looking at $15,000 for this train due to bloody inflation. I hate inflation. It sucks. <laughs> it is a really awesome feature of this game, though. I do, I do really adore that. Alright, so let's get this train. Uh, let's build it down by the actual oil well so we can get oil. They don't appear to be putting any oil on the station though, which kind of sucks. But they will as soon as we get a train on the tracks. Um, that's usually how it works. Because if, if there's nothing going to the station, they will stop like producing the goods at the station. Because there's no point. Like That wouldn't make any sense in real life anyways. Uh, so how much are these? 1,138. Get more of them. More, more, more. Bus forward. New vehicle, we can get planes, we could use airports. Uh, I don't think we have money for airports right now, considering we keep going bankrupt every five seconds, which is not a good look. Uh, and we could actually get shut down, which is not good. Anyways, that'll do. So let's go there, wait for a full load of oil, and then up over there. All right, so let's start her up. Start your engines. Let's see, so the oil will start coming in slowly. Yeah, see, it starts slowly, and then it'll start picking up once they realize, oh, hey, there's a train here. That wants to deliver oil, so let's actually start producing it. Nice and slow to start off with, as you can see. But then the, the production will really pick up, especially because we're in range of two oil wells. Uh, so it's almost full. Almost, almost, almost. And also, that's the other thing. Uh, like I said, the longer you take uh, to deliver something, the less money you get. And if you're waiting at a station a long time, the initial stuff you get in your train will sell for less. So, And here you go. See, now it's filled up instantly and it's going to head straight back over. So this will be getting us quite a lot of money as well. $3,900 per delivery. And now we are in the big time. All right, let's go towns. Where's our biggest town? Uh, not a town that we're at. Why is that town big? There's nothing there. Uh, let's go back to Aftan, where my bus is. My little bus network of one bus. Uh, we're going to build our headquarters is what we're going to do. That's the only reason I was coming here. <laughs> headquarters. Uh, we're going to live. Where should we live? We'll live here in between the towns. Because we, we value each town equally. So that's going to be our headquarters. Like I said, it doesn't really do anything. At least to my knowledge, it doesn't do anything. Uh, okay, so what we're going to want to do... Oh, we got, see, look, we got $28,000 now. Like I said, once you make money, you make money. Uh, certainly, you, you definitely do. Uh, what I want to do is go back over to these trains. Uh, and when this train gets to the station, I want to pause it and actually fill out the train. Because <laughs> we never finished it. So that'll come over here. And we're going to go stop, because uh, it will stop at the end of the station. We'll get a couple more uh, tanker wagons on it. Uh, one, two, I think, is all it needed. I'll start up, and we'll go get some more on the other train as well that we've just done over here. Oh, well, we'll wait till it delivers, because if we do it now, then we'll lose all the money from it. Uh, and then we'll, yeah, so we'll upgrade this train to have a few more uh, tanker wagons, so we can take more oil. We need more. Alright, so that'll stop there. Okay, construction. One, two, three, four. That fill out the station. And that's good. Alright, so what we can do now is actually start building another rail track. A rail track? A railroad. I was going to say train track. And then I changed it to railroad. Then I said rail track. Because that's a word. Uh, <laughs> oh dear. And so we can go there, head up, and go straight across. And now, because we're making crap tons of money, well, at least for now anyways, it's, it's not really that much, only 30,000, but we're making it faster than we used to, 
we can just build a track without having to worry. Uh, which is awesome. <laughs> ah, see this? This is a tycoon game. Uh, this and the Rollercoaster Tycoon franchise are real tycoon games in my opinion. I mean, there was a... Um, oh, I can't... Stop tracking away. Uh, requires a bridge. Oh, are you serious? I can't edit it because of that. That track I've already built there. That's annoying. Seriously? Uh, all right, fine. Let's go back. Uh, I don't know, because some some recent like tycoon game, not naming any names specifically because I can't think of any. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> uh, they just don't. They don't have the charm that these old games used to have. Because there really is a tycoon aspect in this game. You really have to sort of earn your way uh, up and and actually achieve goals. Um, specifically, actually, Adventure Park. I mean, it's, it's not called tycoon, but it is a tycoon game. Uh, Adventure Park that I played a little while ago, and also came out a little while ago, sucked. That was the worst game ever. It was trying to be like Theme Park, but it was a crappy version of Theme Park. Um, also, this is really, really annoying me, so I'm just going to jump over here. And hopefully that train doesn't come while we're doing this. Because um, <laughs> that would be kind of annoying. There we go. <laughs> How have we fixed it? Um, yeah, anyways, then we can go through without a problem. Yeah, uh, it's just that game was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> it was flat out terrible. That was that was all. This is just amazing. I said so this is gonna come down here. This station can actually be longer, or not, because we don't have enough money. <laughs> Where is that train anyway? It kind of disappeared. Oh, did it get lifted off the tracks when I was doing? I guess when ah, uh, probably when I was working on the tracks, it got lifted off. But I think I think that's what it does. All right, we'll put it back in a minute. Uh, we're gonna extend the station to there. Not that we need to, but we will. I mean, the stations are. Horribly uneven, but <laughs> whatever. All right, where's our train? It would have got lifted off, didn't it? Didn't it? Uh, no position, yes. Put you there. Away you go! All right, and then we'll save up a bit of, bit of money and get a second train on these tracks. Which will be very, very good and very, very profitable. Oh, we haven't done a station on this half of the tracks. Well, we can do that now. Uh, wait for a bit more money because this costs quite a bit. Uh, $14,000. Fantastic. We'll just fill out this now. Like this. Nice. And then we'll build another train. We'll save up a bit of money though, so we'll fast forward. And uh, Oh, I've picked up the train again, have I? Sorry. <laughs> I don't know how I keep doing that, but let's leave it. <laughs> Alright, anyway, so that's going to pick up all the oil. Doesn't appear to be producing too much oil though. I don't know if it's because I lifted up the train for a while. That might be it. Um, not quite sure. Hopefully it starts producing more. Because you can see it's, it's actually having to wait now, which isn't very good. There it goes, finally. So let's see how much it's producing. 70 tons, 90, 100. See, it's already over 100. I don't know, maybe it's just because yeah, the train was gone for a little while. Oh, new plane! We could probably build an airport. How much does it cost? Uh, small. You can only build a small airport. Uh, on flat ground, it shall cost us 20, oh, 25,000. Maybe we should do that. I, can, I, mean, I can show you the planes because I haven't shown that off before. Um, I want to do this over here somewhere. Oh, wait, actually, let's check the biggest town again. Uh, we, we Actually, we don't have to deliver passengers, but we will, because that's fun. Uh, so we're going to put an uh, airport there. It's going to cost us 27000 Oh, we have like just a few dollars short. We can go right there. And then the next biggest town is this one. Oh, look, this is the one that we were at before. Uh... And we'll put the airport probably just in here somewhere. Which will cost us 99,000. Not there. <laughs> Maybe up here will be cheaper. Yeah, 31,000. Right, let's fast forward. We'll put it there. Wait, wait till we actually get money for it. 35,000 it is. Come on, where's my money? Show me potato salad. We're looking at $11,000. What's going on? Um, Maybe oil production is down. Because we really are not getting much money right now. I'll go check on that in a second. But I want to build this bloody airport. 20,000, there we go. We've got a delivery. I'm not sure what's going on. Either production is severely down, uh, uh, oil well is closed and I haven't noticed. Uh, that one's closing down and there appears to be a train station there. Not sure if it's my... Hey, I can like place my airport through this little... Ha! Look at that, 100,000. I, I didn't know you could place it through this little preview window. That's awesome. I mean, it's probably just like a glitch of the engine, really, but... Anyways, uh, 36, there we go, we've got an airport there now. Alright, now let's see what's going on with our trains and why we're not making that much money. 
Uh, have we still got oil wells, right? Definitely, these are definitely still producing oil. Yeah, it's still, still got oil, so that's still open. Still accepts oil. Yep. I don't know. Maybe this one's not producing much. Now, where'd that train go? Is that off the tracks again? Why is that train always off the tracks? What the hell? No position again. Have I have I done something wrong? Yeah, let's let me watch this train. <laughs> Okay, it's like instantly broken down. Well, that would have been why we're losing money, because we've got a train sitting there doing nothing. And now this oil field has got nothing coming out of it. Um, what's going on with that? Why does it keep doing that? I'm really not sure. How oh, long is it going to be fixed? There we go. Um, Alright, so that's going to slowly start producing oil again. <laughs> let's watch it. Why does it, it keep leaving the track? Let me, let me, let's, let's watch and see what happens. Uh Yes, it's probably it's probably my stupidity at some point, but um, right, there goes the train. No worries, no worries so far. It's broken down again though, which <laughs> is not ideal. And then it just jumps off the tracks uh, every time there. Not quite sure why. Uh, every time it seems to like want to turn around here, it just jumps off the tracks. I don't know why it does that. Maybe this will be a situation where we join the tracks together! Uh, but we will have to remove that, that station there. Um, didn't have to do it like that, could have just removed the actual station. But we'll put signal lights there. And, oh actually they can just be dual way signals. Like that. We don't have two trains yet, but I'm just preparing for two trains. Alright, maybe this will work better. Because apparently that station was glitched. Not quite sure why, some of you probably know. You self-professed experts of locomotion would know, I'm sure. Um, anyways, let me put it there, but turn it around. Um, how is our reliability? We might have to replace these trains soon just to get more reliable on them. Uh, we also need to buy an airplane soon as well. Alright, so that's, that's actually filled up with oil now. Let's watch it, make sure it can actually make it to the station and back again without dying. Oh, yeah, that station's not long enough, but it works now. Uh, the problem is if we get a second train, because the station's not long enough, uh, the signal lights won't work and they'll crash and, and blow up. But we'll come to that problem when we do. Let's buy a plane. Uh, where are my airports, first of all? <laughs> I don't know where I've built them. There's one over here. Uh, oh, God, wrong way. Here it is. Probably got no one waiting there. Nope. Uh, we should probably we should put a bus stop there so we get the bus going to the airport as well. We'll do that soon. Uh, Alright, build some aircraft. Okay, what have we got? We can take the most passengers. 13, 17, 8, 4. That's got 17, so let's build that one. So it's going to go from Kobe, Kobe Isba Airport. I don't know. Names. Too hard. Uh, over to that one. So it's just going to start. Unfortunately, there's not going to be any passengers there. So <laughs> that's why it's good to have a bus stop there, because that will keep the flow of passengers going, even when there's no planes. Uh, which is probably a good idea. So we're going to put a bus stop there right next to the airport. We're going to alter this WMC bus that we have. Uh, and it's going to go one, two, three on the route. Now, it's actually an empty bus right now, which kind of sucks. <laughs> There's nobody in it. Well, it is a pretty small town, I guess. There we are. Nice. And how's our plane doing? Has it got anyone on it? It's empty. <laughs> Yeah, it's because the other airport probably has no one there. Uh, the only problem with a bus going to the airport is it's going to take all the passengers. Yep, there's nothing waiting. And now it's empty. Uh, yeah, we should probably wait for some passengers. <laughs> so this plane is just going to constantly lose money as of right now anyways. Uh, where's the airport? Here it is. We need to set up a bus sort of system in this town here. Uh, to get some people actually going to the airport. <laughs> Quick, I need to catch a, catch a bus to get to the airport that's just down the street because I can't be bothered to walk. Ah, uh, you silly, silly people. Alright, go from there to there. Let's get the flow of passengers ha happening. Three passengers waiting though, so we will actually get someone on the plane now, which is good. Let's see how much we get. We're currently getting minus 300 a month. Uh, come on, where's my payout? Where's my payout? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. $148. Wow. Really not worth. <laughs> Do you have anyone? It's empty again, coming back. I, re I seriously need to like... Set it to wait for passengers, because it's just going to keep coming back empty. Now move down. Wait for a full load of passengers. And do it on both. 
It might not be the best idea to do this, but I, I want it to have some people in it before it bloody goes anywhere because it doesn't seem to be making any money. Seven passengers. Good. Eight. It's funny, it's like, I just want to go to the bus stop. I don't want to get on a plane, but they have to get on the plane. Alright, I got 13 passengers. Come on, 15. Almost, almost 17. We should have done a smaller plane. We really didn't need a 17 passenger plane for these two tiny, tiny towns. Alright, here we go. Going off to the other, the other town now. Gotta keep clicking it to follow it. Gotta keep clicking it to follow it. Circling in for landing. Here it comes. How much do we get? How much do we get? 680 bucks. Really, really not worth it. <laughs> Whatever. It's making money. That'll do. It's making some magic. Um, seems one reference right there. All right, let's get back over to our trains because these are actually what we're supposed to be doing. Speaking of which, let's have a look at our <laughs> challenge where we're at. Five years left to complete it. We're 21% done, which isn't too bad, actually. Um, but what we got to do is alter this station here. Um, so that we can fit a train in the station. <laughs> Preferably uh, fit an actual train. Uh, oh, I can't. I have to click on this track to edit it. Which is kind of annoying. Now, let me remove these signals first. Because they're going to get in the way for now. Uh, and those ones. How, so how long was it? I can't remember how long I made the station. Let me go back down over here again. Uh, so it is one, two, three, four, five. Is that right? I've lost count now. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Is that 13? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yes, it was. All right, so let's get back over here now. And let's build a station that's actually long enough. So we're just going to build it next to this train here, this, this station here, because we can go straight past it here, so it'll be better better space to do it. Uh, so we'll leave one gap and this will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And this will be our station here. No, it's going to be the same station. We don't want to change the station. So let's come straight down here so we can actually fit a train on it. And this... Another situation of it freezing uh, until I stopped recording, which is weird. Uh, but anyways, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. So it's not really an issue. That'll go there. We're going to remove that track. And that track, actually, which, which track is the train on, first of all? Yeah, okay, it's on this one. So we can uh, just adjust this other one here. We're going to get rid of this. And... And... If we go, like, this way... Oh, I don't really want to join the stations together, though, is the thing. If we do it like this, can we fit it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11. 11. Damn it. <laughs> That's annoying. 12, 13. There we are. God, this is awkward. This isn't going to join, is it? <laughs> Alright, if we do this and then... That, that'll that work. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. Uh, not the prettiest train tracks. But hey, doesn't need to be. This, this oil refinery also keeps producing goods, but I'm not taking them. Oh, how many do I place? I don't know. Let's do more. Station is too spread out. Yeah, that's something that happens as well. Uh, anyways, build train, because we have a billion dollars now. Oh, we got a new train. We should upgrade all of our other trains to this one as well. Wow, it's like twice as powerful as the last one. Uh, I apparently can't place it there. Uh, there's a train approaching. There's no trains. That track's not joined to the other one, is it? It might be somewhere, I guess. Have a look. No, the tracks aren't joined at all. We talk. Hang on. Oh. Where are they joined? Apparently on this side of the, the lights, it's saying the tracks are joined. I can put it there and on that side, but it can't go here. Hopefully that's just a glitch, and when we actually put the train on the tracks, it should be fine, but we'll see. Alright, do we have a new oil tanker? No, I still got a small one. That's kind of sucky. Because they, they eventually invent bigger wagons that can carry... Oh, it's annoying. Uh, that can carry more oil, which is good. But I don't know if they're going to get around to that. Anyway, wait for a full load of oil. Deliver it to... Wait, what is that? Sick... Sick iron bed. Sick iron bed. I don't know. Whatever. All right, so it's going <laughs> to wait for oil. I'm not going to try to pronounce any more names because I just make a fool out of myself. Uh, 105 tons. It is ready to... No, it's not ready to go. It needs to wait for more. <laughs> it's almost there, though. Uh, there we go. 140 tons. Now, let's see if there's any issues with the, the train. It seems to be. 
What is it? I don't know what's wrong with these tracks. They're not touching anywhere. They literally are not... The tracks aren't touching. There's something like glitched out about this track. I don't know. It's really weird. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's really, really weird. All right, let's just take this back and then maybe we will just have to join it to the other track and just use the one station because it doesn't seem to want to use the other one. So, I don't know. It's really weird. I'm going to do double signals there, double signals there, and there where we can fit them. And that train should... Wait. Oh, why would you go up to that point there? Oh, and now it's going all the way back. Yeah, this- uh, why is that train coming down here? Oh my god, what are you doing? This is why you don't have two tracks! It doesn't work! Uh, <laughs> uh, um, I'll get rid of those signals, I think that's the problem. And get rid of these ones too. So I wanted two stations, but I might have to build another station! Next to that one there. That's going to get, like, no money. Alright, well, while they're sort of messing around, let's build another station next to this one. And try and fix it. And then we will replace all of our trains with the new train as well, because that would be a better idea. Um, so that wants to go there, where I want to put it. Uh, this is a bit dangerous to do it while the trains are in motion, but... Bear with me, please. Uh, let me get rid of that piece. There we go. Now they're disconnected. Again, hopefully. And then we'll put the, the station in here. And hopefully we shouldn't have a problem. But we'll see. Of course, we will see. Uh, these don't appear to be producing much oil, which is really, really sucky. Because they constantly are waiting there to get oil. Uh, I wonder how the other ones are going. We'll check up on them soon. Alright, let's see if this train works now. No, it's still wait. Why are you waiting there? There's no, there's no, there's no one else on that track. It's, it doesn't make any sense. Stupid signals. Go away. There you go. You're not going to crash into anything. Yeah, see, there's no problem. It, it was just like glitching out. I don't know. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Right, let's go to my trains. And let's go to the first one. Uh, this is going to the oil field. Yeah, stop. Train, please. Thank you. Let's go to construction. Delete the original front of the train. Construct it. And put on the new train. It'll go a million times faster. Well, maybe not a million. But it will go faster. You stop too. Because you're, you're sucky. And reliability is really low as well. Um... Yeah, you do want to upgrade all your vehicles over time, or at least replace them, because their reliability will drop like a stone. I mean, they didn't even start off good. Look, they start off at 62% reliability, so they don't even start off good. And that guy's delivering oil, so we'll wait till he does that. Alright, stop. Wait, till, You have to wait till it stops, and then we can get rid of the uh, current steam engine and replace it. So that'll go in the bin. Goodbye. Pacific. There we go. Alright, so now we've got all new trains. Uh, how are our buses going? 75% on that one. 57, 59. Yeah, that'd be fine for now. Our trucks are abysmal though. They're are they even making money? Monthly profit, seven, uh, 60 bucks. <laughs> There's no point in having these stop. Just stop. Just get rid of these trucks. They, they're so minimally making money. Are, are they using my road that I built? They are legitimately just using... I built this road and they built trucks over the top of it. That's just rude. That is just really, really rude. Anyways, delete my trucks, don't need them. Uh, there's really no point in having them there. Can I delete my road? Because that would that would really annoy them. Uh, what, what do you mean it belongs to him? I built this road! Ha, huh, there we go. <laughs> That'll teach him. <laughs> Those trucks can't get there. <laughs> Sucker. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Oh, that, that blew up! It blew up! <laughs> this truck legitimately blew up somehow! Just crashed! <laughs> what an idiot! What an idiot! Alright, anyways. <laughs> are we going towards our task? Are we actually anywhere on track towards our task? 29%, we've got four years left. Ooh, we really need to up, uh, up the ante. But, I'm gonna leave it here for this episode, or... 
I don't know, I've probably cut this up into a couple of episodes because it's quite a long session. Uh, probably two episodes. I'll leave it here for now. We'll be back next time. We're going to have to build a lot more train tracks because uh, we got oil there we haven't done. There's tons of oil fields everywhere. We're going to have to build a giant train network and get lots and lots of money. But that will be for next time. I hope you enjoy this because uh, I really enjoy this game and I'm sure you guys are going to be addicted as hell to this uh, if you buy it as well. And um, yes, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Oh, a new bus. Look at that. That's fancy.